Hello everybody, Richard Michael Owen here, and it's a very special day. I'm at Beauty, believe it or not, and we're gonna do the big auto jumble. This is an event I've wanted to do my whole life. And thanks to my friend here, Alistair. Hi there. And then Dog Charlie. We're gonna go into this event. We got the premium access here. This gate is not what I was expecting. It's gonna be a great day. I don't even know where we're going. <laughs> um, so we'd be right about here, and you have basically a big row of exhibitors here. Two fields of dreams. Two fields. There. Oh, three. Three, three fields. It goes on and on, but just this is the National Motor Museum, right. which is the you know the, the Bewley, Bewley proper yep. buildings and things. Then there's a display from Bonhams, the auction house. See all the cars that are being auctioned there. There's something called the Auto Mart, which is where there are cars for sale, private oh, sellers check that of cars. Out. We've got to check, check it out and okay. see what's for sale. And really through here, it's a, it's a random assortment of yeah, let's all see kinds find. of exhibitors. You'll find everything here. Let's get into it. Let's all do right. it. All right, let's go. Okay, we're in the thick of it here. Look at all these stands. Oh my God. I'm at Roger Motors. I love seeing the new old stock boxes there. Look at everything on offer here today. Pretty incredible. Sneak in here, we got badges. NEXK120 badges. MG badges. Wow, there's everything here at Bewley. Look at these new old stock PLs, guys. Perfect for an E-Type. Aren't those amazing? Wow. Man, oh man, this is just blowing me away. Look at this Healy badge bar, guys. I've never seen anything like it. There's two bars going either way to support the spotlights. Wow, what an amazing piece. Oh man, there's, it just goes on and on here. Look at this. Where do we stop? How cool are those? Awesome. Look at the signs. Wow, there's so much greatness here. It's the density too. Wow. Okay, Alistair had his eye on attack yesterday. And by what miracle will it still be here on the second day of Beulie? <laughs> I believe in miracles. It'll be there. It'll be there. Okay, let's go see. Okay. Look at these. <laughs> Just love that van. Look at all the vendors. Holy moly. Oh, wow. Okay, Alistair's looking for his tech. Let's see if it's still here. By what miracle? It's here. It's here? It's Let's here. see it. That's it right there. Oh wow, look at that tack everybody. He said, uh, I've been... Uh, what a beauty. Here. Yeah. Wow. I've only got one piece. Old Smith's. Yeah. Can you grab it or? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's only a one piece what does it look like on the back? Yeah. All the original. Is it, wow, look at that. Yeah, it's a fair age. That's amazing. This is a match for one I have in my little pre-war sports car. That looks so also awesome. Has Smiths with the bezel and the color. It's just right. Look at this, guys. Uh, Regulate. The item has just been sold. I'm sorry. That was the best item. The tack. The tack. Got it. Woohoo! Victory. Look at the rest of the stuff here on this stand. Horns. We got an SS. That's pretty incredible. Love seeing the HF horns here. Do you get this? Look at the regulators. You only bring in one. <laughs> Fuel caps. Wow. There's so much here. Look at that horn. And the lights. Thanks for that. Man, well, at least oh, you can go home. I mean, this is my mate's sword. Holy, look at these down here. Wow, 550 pounds. Holy, what a great stand. It's a good thing to have. It's just, 
Look at that Del Lodge radiator. Where do you see, where do you see Del Lodge radiators? Very, very happy. Holy moly. Look at this sports coil, everybody. 15 pounds. Still has the cap, the decal. Dated 77. Holy, that's a pickup, I think. Oh, look at the shocks being made here. Friction dampers. All the bits. Amazing. Here we are, the real car company, Rolls-Royce Bentley, Darby enthusiasts. Curious to see what they have for sale here today. What's your best item? Ooh, what's our best yeah. item? No, we try. The shiny ones, obviously. The big lights? Yeah, yeah. yeah indeed. Uh, yeah. P100 headlights. Oh, well. oh, those are P100s? Yeah. Wow, they're massive. What, what size are those like? 12 uh, inch? 11. 11 inch? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what a beauty pair. <laughs> makes all the difference yeah yeah spirit of ecstasy here hmm. all the tools look at that spanner there amazing wow. there's a sign after my heart wonderful okay i've never seen this before this is a delivery service point alistair tells me so you can actually buy car parts, deliver them here, and they'll take it to the to your car. How amazing is that? <laughs> Made it to the cars for sale area. So these are all private cars that are for sale. And there are a lot. There's even more behind me here. Look at that old MG. What is that? Like a tour? A Y tour? No, it's a WA. Wow, what is that? I love the color. Fully restored VA tour for 37,000 pounds. That's a big old MG. And uh, is that a Lada? I think so. MGB. But what caught my eye here is this E-Type. What's going on here? <laughs> look at the white, look at the flares on the back. Holy. Look at that. Look at the back of this E-Type, guys. Unreal. Yeah, Bonhams have an amazing display here. Got a great pair of Aston Martins here at Bonhams. This DB24 Mark III sold for 132,000 pounds. And there's a lot of people checking out this Lagonda four-door. I've never seen one in my life. This one sold for 52,100 pounds. I just love the front end of these Lagondas. Look at that quad headlight treatment, the grill. Pretty amazing piece. Let's have a look at the rear. Yeah, what a neat car. Never seen one before. Awesome. Yeah, some pretty nice pre-wars here that they sold yesterday. But this Aston Martin one and a half liter just oozes originality and patina. Look at the seats in here. It's a four-seater, which I think is probably a little rare. Maybe, I'm not sure. I don't know my Aston pre-wars that well. But yeah, look at this. Pretty cool. Look at the badge on there. And these cycle fenders that are pretty wild. Yeah, beautiful pre-war Aston Martin here at Bonhams. Oh, the steering wheel looks really old. Look at that. Beautiful. Pretty amazing sight here. It looks like three barn fine cars probably came from the same place got this Riley here look at the engine in there is it a one and a half liter yeah one and a half liter 12 horsepower holy moly looks like a bit of a project a rover I've never seen anything like this this is a 1939 rover 20 Tickford 
that's pretty amazing. And then a pre-war Jaguar, I think it's a three and a half liter. <laughs> Look at the door on this Rover. Holy, quite the project. Probably the most impressive Jaguar display I've seen so far, northernjaguar.com. Lots of really rare bits, transmission tunnels, stuff I like to see, like instrument panels like that, bumpers, E-type bell housing, cylinder heads, quite a wonderful collection of stuff. I'm definitely going to check out the website. Look at this. Let's just go in and deep dive a little further here. There's drive shafts, hinges, transmissions. Amazing. Original switches, gauges. It's a little overwhelming to be honest. There's so much here at Bewley. Look at this. Just checking out these steering wheels here. A lot of pre-war. And look at that, an ACA steering wheel. Wow. Okay, this tool tray by Hazit. I am really unhappy I cannot take this home. It does not fit in my luggage, but wow, that is just spectacular. Got the other one over there as well. Nice pre-wars here. Got this custom Brazier Curtis with an 8.2 liter engine. Look at that, people. Valve train, external. That's pretty amazing. Behind it is an Invicta and a Rolls-Royce 20. Nice set of cars. Got a BAS tent here. This is where a lot of our upholstery comes from. This multicolored seat. <laughs> Love it. Hi. Awesome. What beautiful work. On the office chair. Oh, I want one of those. Wow, that's amazing. Look at that E-type late 4.2 office chair. Oh man, I'm in love. I know, look at all those keys. 20 quid for all those? Wow. When you want original keys. Yeah, we do have a lot of stock. Look at the seals here. Rolls, so much upholstery, wow. I'd say that's Looks like a Brescia Bugatti here on the back of this truck. Wow. Look at that early radiator there. Amazing. A little engine. It looks like an original body too. Very cool. All right, I found the best stand here. The guys at S&G Barrett. Probably a lot of Jaguar parts here. And uh, let's do a tour of the stand. What do you guys got? So the front here, uh, we've got a lot of our seconds, secondhand things. So you guys sell secondhand? Yeah. We, I had no idea. We used to have containers full of really? you know, second okay. parts. Yeah. And uh, parts which have had you know, slight damage to right? them. Cosmetics, okay. cosmetic damage mainly. Um, so there was containers full. We've managed to get it down a bit now. So we've just yeah. got one container left to clear. Okay. And this is just a small sample of some of the stuff that was from the container. Right. Um, which we've brought along with us today. Um, and obviously we've got all of that. And the new, new parts the in the back, the new brakes. We've got to have a look at those. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Look at this. So instantly the new calipers. Yeah, the four pot caliper I put, conversion. Yeah. Guys, I have a video coming up. I got the new Girling calipers to install on my E-Type. So we're gonna see a lot more of these. And the brake fluid reservoir caps. Yeah. Bumpers, power steering conversions. Look at that. Oh, this is you, fantastic. This yeah. Is a, this is a great conversion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I fitted one to an XK150. It transformed it. It's like you're driving an XJ. Absolutely, yeah, you're, you're right. 
and the brake mass brakes master cylinders here We've got the Lucas really high quality Range stuff here. I'm sure you've all the Luke at class oh yeah screen jet of course high torque starter from Lucas that's cool never yeah. seen that before and these actually come with a lifetime warranty now oh really yeah fantastic yeah, and the screen jet in both guises all the lenses and the bases amazing amazing stuff and a big radiator here what's that for well i was hoping you might be able to tell me <laughs> honestly I, that might be a mark 10 or a 420 i'm we, not sure we can't work it out yeah, we can't yeah. work it out um, we've been asked a few times this weekend but uh, <laughs> yeah all right well thanks for the tour guys thanks for You're the service i love s g barrett long live s g barrett <laughs> thank you need a regulator they're regulators which probably well I, they will definitely not work <laughs> but, um, okay everybody there's just no way i can d even do this whole show every which way i look unbelievable amount of vendors parts connections networking it is really unbelievable. This Bewley has really blown me away. This really is the Mecca. And there's no way I could do it with just a few hours I've had here. But yeah, really spectacular show. I'm super impressed. I can't believe I'm not buying one of everything. Everywhere I look, it's just so amazing. Rows and rows and rows of vendors, cars, parts, pieces, bits, signs. I'm just overwhelmed. Top show, top show. Okay, so I did a kind of a crazy thing. I bought all these keys, thinking, oh, I'm gonna take them home with me to BC. But then I realized there's these key guys here. And I think this is the better home for them. These guys have an amazing display of keys. If you look here, look at them all up in here. And I think if I donate these to this guy, these keys are gonna come to a better home. Let's see what he says. Excuse me. Yes, sir. Can I give you this box of keys? Why is that then? Because I bought them thinking I was gonna take them back to Canada. Yeah. But I think you're a better home. Will that be right. useful? Well, this, 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 this is magnificent because it's, um, on the here, yeah, there's some original keys. Right, they're so, all original. They're, they're, they're sort of no, there's some rephrase, but the yeah. original ones are very yeah. good. Yeah. So, which case, I thank you very much, and, and I'll give you a card. Okay, so if anybody if ever, in yeah. the future, if everybody needs a, a classic car key, then just yeah, do not hesitate to contact me. There we go. Awesome. That's my good deed of the day. And if you Google Stan Campbell, you'll find yeah. that um, quite a surprise. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> Cheers. Thanks. Okay, everybody, that was Bewley. But this video's not over. We're gonna see what my friend Alistair bought for his Aston Martin. What an event, oh my, oh my. Oh, and I bought the ACA steering wheel. That was my purchase of the day. Okay, gonna finish up the day with Alistair and his amazing DB24 Mark III. And he made a real score today, and that's original tools for his car and he's going to show me where they go here yeah so every dbt4 mark 3 has a toolkit in this location uh here in the firewall and i've got you know mostly reproduction bits and pieces which are 
you know, at least it completes the kit, but wow, an original, original set today. Incredibly difficult to find. Only at the Bewley Auto Jumble. Let's you see. You know, wow, every, every single bit for this Aston Martin toolkit. There's more in the bag. I don't know if we want to lay, wow. them, lay them all out here. Look at that. It's, have... You can really see the difference between the Repro and the original. Yeah. Look at that, even in the screwdriver. Yeah, very much so. Wow. So, thrilled to bits. Took me many years to find this. Only at Bewley would you find such yeah, a thing. Yeah, right, eh? Um, awesome. And, uh, you know, for reasonable money. So I guess they're that. probably going to fit, right? Oh, they are going to fit. Yeah. Should, should we? <laughs> let's see. I wanna, should I? Should we? Should we do it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's let's go for it. Let's. I think one or two of these might be might be genuine, so I'll lay them to one side. But let's remove everything from the everything from the toolkit, and then we'll replace. See his engine here. Mm -hmm. Pretty amazing presentation. I just love the black coated SUs. Oh, here it goes. Okay, one by one. Yeah. Another piece of the puzzle solved. Yeah. yeah. Look yeah. at that. Uh -huh. Yeah, just like it was made for it. Yeah, right? what's going on here? <laughs> yeah, so uh, you can see these David Brown Aston Martin markings. Yeah. Oh. Whitworth sizes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's just a bit of a jigsaw puzzle to get these away. Look at that. Senior and screwdriver. So difficult, much better. So much find. better. Yeah, that's a that's an amazing thing. And I think this you have an original Tommy bar there too. Yeah, got one more. Wow, that's bloody brilliant, man. Very happy with that because as you can see, the rest of the car is a genuine yeah. old thing. Beauty, so, awesome. Uh, well, congratulations. What an you. awesome purchase. Thank you very much. Okay, well, with that, I'm gonna end this video. But many thanks to Alistair for driving me here in his amazing Aston. We're headed back to London. Yeah, Bewley, I can't recommend it enough. What an amazing event. All right, I'm out. See you later. See you later, everybody. Bye-bye.